Okay, the next feature I want to show you regarding uh, window tablet like the Acer Aconia W3 8 inch is that the keyboard um, pretty much you can hook up any uh, uh, keyboard whether it's USB or wireless uh, using radio signal or Bluetooth it should work. Now I have two keyboard I'm going to show you that is actually um, actually three types of keyboard. One is wireless using uh, 2.4 gigahertz radio wave. Second one is this um, uh, foldable plastic uh, um, keyboard and then the mini type of keyboard you can hook it up. Alright so let's go and see if I can find software. Where is it? There we go. Uh, Word. Let's try Word. There we go. Load that up and I'll show you. Now you need a special adapter obviously for this and you can check my website educatetube.com slash store to get more information on how to purchase this under 10 bucks. Okay, if you're not, you know, you can always search an auction site and find one yourself. This is a female USB standard adapter, uh, but you have to have this special micro USB connected to it like this. Okay, now let's start with um, just, you know, just normally you would have just, you know, if you're using this just as a tablet, you just normally um, load up the uh, on-screen uh, keyboard, which I say, hello. Okay, there we go, and period, enter. That's fine, right? But let's say you know you want to do more work. What happened? Well, bring this along. This is a um, uh, a foldable, waterproof, uh, plastic or um, very strong type of keyboard, and you unfold it, and bam, there we go. You got a full keyboard there, okay, like that, waterproof, okay. I bought this a couple years ago and guess what I still can use it that's the amazing that's the power of um, Windows tablet is that uh, if it's um, compatible with Windows 7 it should be compatible with with Windows 8 now that's connected together notice I'm using a standard USB keyboard and when I connect it BAM it should work watch this okay let me if I can zoom out to show you what I'm talking about here okay so I'm gonna show you and type in um, hello again. There we go. I know you can see that. Yeah, I think you can. Okay, let's bring it in closer. Um, hello. Period. How are you? Question. Oops. Oh, question mark. There we go. As you can see, it works perfectly. And this keyboard I bought for under, I'm not sure, under 30 bucks or 20 bucks, I don't know, it was a couple years ago. It's foldable and you can bring it along anywhere you want. So that's an option. And it's so, it's so convenient and so fast. Just click it, plug it into the USB, and it's done. It's, it works. No need to download any uh, drive or anything like that. No need to modify your tablet. Okay, so that's one. Okay, move that out of the way. What if you have this mini keyboard? Well, same thing. If this is um, Windows 7 compatible, it should be compatible with Windows 8. Now, this is actually Windows XP, and the, this one too is both compatible with Win, in Windows XP. So, most of the keyboard that has um, USB connector should work instantly. So, here, let's do it again. Let's connect this up. There we go. And you can see the light flashing. And I'm going to try it again. I'll show you that this keyboard also works. How, oops, I put the uh, cap lock on. How are you doing today? I am fine. Now, this keyboard's a little bit, I don't like this mini one. It's not the best one out there, but like I said, you have, like I said again, you have uh, so many options for the USB keyboard. You don't have to stick with what I have here. But well, my point is that you, this window tablet. Uh, 8 inch uh, Acer Iconia W3 is very powerful. Anything you hook up to uh, that's Windows 8 and 7 compatible should work. Now you want to test it out first and if it doesn't work you can always return it but you can see here it works perfectly. The next thing I want to test is the last keyboard. I just want to show you the uh, wireless actually works. Now this is just this is not a full keyboard this is actually a number keyboard right so I'm gonna unplug this one, the other keyboard, and plug a wireless keyboard to this. And you can see 
this uh, 2.4 gigahertz wireless keyboard will work instantly and this is a number pad let's turn it on okay there we go you can see the number now um, it's set there's two settings internet and media I, I could actually turn on the volume directly with this and turn it off so it's, it's fully compatible uh, even though this is actually Windows XP compatible it actually is Windows 8 compatible as well it acts as like if you look at the keyboard here uh, wireless it has a volume in volume out so this can be my media player okay amazing anything works that's what I like about Windows tablet so for example let's type in a number here enter and let's go 23 plus uh, 56 so you can see um, it works super well let me, let me see if I can find um, okay let me see reduce this for a minute I'm, I'm gonna see if I can find a calculator on my tablet let's go to calculator Calculator. there we go okay it's too fancy for me but anyway look at 56 there we go it works see if you can see that number there 56 uh, minus um, 45 enter and it works you see that amazing so even um, anything I, I, I can actually uh, do this from far away and it works let's see uh, let's see let's zoom this in here okay so let's say um, 456 um, plus 569 and bam it works so the, the like I said the, the cool thing about the the tablet is any window devices like that's USP uh, like a keyboard wireless or uh, wired works perfectly even this um, compatible um, wireless keyboard that's just a number keyboard great for na navigating like say this actually have a, a media um, uh, cha uh, button and it also have let's see if I click it again it can be an internet let's see if I can go on the internet okay um, let's go to tablet and let's load up uh, let's try uh, Internet Explorer okay and uh, so now there's a button here for the internet I can actually go click on home it go home there we go you see it has a home button because I my default home is Google uh, search engine and um, it can go forward backward for you know if I let's say I serve the web let's see I can go um, bestbuy.com let's say okay there we go in Best Buy and I, I and then let's say I want to go backwards there we go back to that go forward you you can now make this into you can see that the the possibilities you can create a website or web page and, um, and you know as you navigate through it and use this button uh, back and forth it becomes like a PowerPoint see I mean it's the un, it's unlimited the amount of thing you can do with the this tablet the window tablet alright I'm gonna show you other things you can do with this tablet as well let's have a look